Good evening. Good evening, class. Can you see me? Can you hear me? Yes, to yes, teacher. I can be wrong. Problem, but I can hear. I can hear you. Are you still having the same problems? David? Yes, I don't know why, but I think there is some problem with the company. Mm. Yeah, it could be. Um, maybe there's some problems with the cables. Maybe yes. Mm hmm. Mm. Well, hopefully you can solve that soon. Yeah. Okay. Um, all right. I've seen many, some more people are joining. Um, hello, Haiti. I don't know if you can hear me. Hello, William. Hi, good evening. Good evening. How are you? Good, teacher. Thanks for us. Good. I'm glad to hear that. Um, and I also see Jose Osmin. Yes, teacher. How are you? Um, I'm not feeling okay, but so I can see that. So far, so good. You're 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 not feeling okay. Did you say? Uh, yeah, because um, I had flu. Oh, I see. I'm sorry to hear that. Yes. Um, yeah. Okay. Well, I hope you feel better. Yeah. Thanks. Yeah. Okay. Hello, Dora. Welcome. Hello, teacher. How are you? Uh, I'm fine. You fine? Yes. Okay. Good. Yes. Good. Good. I'm glad to. I'm. I'm glad to to know that you're feeling better. That you're feeling good. Thank you, teacher. Yeah. Okay. Hello, Harvin. Hello, Harvin. Hello, teacher. How are you? I am writing right now, teacher. Yeah, I can hear that. <laughs> okay, thank you for connecting. Um, are you are you going to be home soon? Yes, in ten minutes. I'm going to be my house. Oh, about ten minutes. Okay, okay. All right. Good. 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 Excellent. Um, we'll wait for you. <laughs> Hello, Heidi. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. How are you? I'm fine. Good, good, good. Excellent. Happy Valentine's. Oh, <laughs> thank you. Thank you. Oh, yeah, that's right. I, I keep on forgetting that you guys. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm. I'm kind of. They don't like, celebrate over there. Uh, I don't know. I I really don't know that, but um, eh, I didn't really see very much. Oh, well, actually, yes, I did. Some, I seen a little bit of activity, um, uh, but not so much. Um, yeah, and um. It, remember that for me it's now the uh, the 15th mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah mm, it's true <laughs> uh -huh, uh -huh, yeah but um but i did see a little a little bit of activity yesterday not not very much um mostly like i i saw the um like uh the bakeries and things like that having a the like cakes in shapes of hearts and things like that. That's what I saw. Uh huh. So, but but not very much more activity. I it was like, I I almost couldn't notice that it was a different day. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, hello, Ana Claudia. Hi, teacher. Good evening. How are you? Good, good. How are you? I'm doing. I'm doing fine. Thank you for yeah? asking. I'm doing well, or I'm doing fine. Mm, I'm um, both are okay. Both are okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm doing and fine. So far, I'm so doing... good. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. So far. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good, good. Good. At home, and we're having good times. Good, good, good. Mm -hmm. We've been we've missed you. When? Uh, because yesterday, no. It's yeah, a... I was here. I was in class on Friday. Uh, on Friday, <laughs> right? Yeah, on Friday. Yeah, yeah. Yesterday, I've been working with yeah. ID. And... Yeah, that's right. Yeah, you're right. You're right. <laughs> Yeah, uh -huh. absolutely right about that. Yeah. No, don't worry. It's okay. Um, yeah. So, how's the weather over there oh, right now? During the afternoon, I felt like I felt hot, but right mm -hmm. now it's showing. Let me check. Right now, my city is showing. I don't know why it's showing thirties. Let me check. Ah, da, da. yeah show 30 because i we have fans turn it on yeah wow it's like no it's like 28 right now 28 27 hmm mm -hmm. wow right now it's uh four for you uh -huh. yeah right now it's four here but it feels like one. <gasps> my goodness mm -hmm. but now you have uh, the appropriate cl uh, clothes, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I'm, I, I'm starting to, yeah. Because when I, when I came here, when I just came here, um, I was like, oh, it was like my, my clothes were, yeah. Do you they, just travel with your t-shirts, your jeans? It's like a, <laughs> in the tropical weather. <laughs> yeah, exactly. The, the, clo the clothes that I brought were summer clothes, you know. Yeah, exactly. Because, you know, so I mean that was all there was, right? So, I mean, yeah, that's all there no, is. No, and because of the pack, because of the 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 package, no, the yes, the luggage, the luggage. luggage. I'm sorry, because of the luggage, and the weight and the all the policies, the uh, all these companies exactly uh, they have. Mm -hmm. So that is. The reason wh one why you just travel with the basic thing, the mm -hmm. most important mm -hmm. thing, right? Yeah, exactly. Yes, I think we always think uh, that well, I will purchase clothes right there. That yeah. happened in the last trip I made in Peru. I, I thought that I was prepared with the, the appropriate clothes. Mm -mm. I had to purchase <laughs> yeah. gloves, sweaters, hats. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it was so funny. Yeah. No, but exactly. Ask me now to in this now nowadays, all those clothes are <laughs> in the <laughs> they're they're in my clothes. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Well, the good thing is that I'm gonna I I hope to continue using them here. So oh yeah, yeah, yeah. That's so right. yeah, so it, it's it's worth uh, purchasing the clothes. Exactly. Right? At the end, it's like a kind of investment, right? Yeah, yeah, exactly. So I've gotten a few shawls, um, scarves, hats, <gasps> socks. Boots, I guess. Boots. I had to buy boots here. Yes, I, I had to buy boots. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. It's, uh, it's uh, you know, everything. It you is a different need... outfit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I, my, my, my wardrobe is completely different now. Ah, I just can't imagine. <laughs> mm -hmm. awesome. That's life. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hello, Eliana. Welcome. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Thank you. Good evening. How are you? Mm, without, without credit, but mm, it's not something that. Yeah, it's not something that 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 maybe. Let me just in bed, but when I came home at around six and a half, I fell asleep. Six thirty. Six thirty. Mm -hmm. I fell asleep and mm -hmm. I rest like an hour. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. And okay. I'm here ready, teacher, for the class. 
Okay, good. I like that attitude. <laughs> I heard that you were talking with Ana Claudia Bar about your new wardrobe. Oh, yes. Yes. I've had to buy Amazing. a new wardrobe. <laughs> yeah. Um, it's yeah, I've, I've, I've like completely, I, I've had to, to change everything. Uh, by, I've I had to buy warmers. You guys know what warmers are? It's like, mm, yeah. Yeah. That, it, like, yeah. That clothes that, that say you like mm, warm. Yeah. 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 But, um, so it's like, uh, a, a, you buy these like kind of leggings, something like that. Leggings, yeah, and, exactly. And you wear that. I've everywhere. always been curious to purchase one of those because I saw them, my friends wearing them, but they so thin. Uh, I don't know. They, they they don't look like so uh, uh, a tough. Uh, uh, oh my god, <laughs> Tela, ay, <laughs> fabric. Fabric. I'm sorry, I got amnesia today. <laughs> it's okay. It's yeah, okay. it doesn't look like a, a fabric that is so different. It looks so nice. It looks, it looks normal. Yeah, I I have a friend that she went to Spain a couple of years ago, and she she told us that when she went with with her husband, the weather was cold completely cold and and she she used the that kind of of clothes no, she wore she, she, she wore. wore yeah mm -hmm. she wore thank you yeah. she wore that kind of clothes and it's comfortable she doesn't feel like different or awkward mm -hmm. yeah. it depends on the fabrics maybe right mm-hmm mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah, it, it does. It does depend on that. Uh, but um, yeah, it's you. You gotta. You gotta know where to buy and what to buy. And yeah. So and it's it's also important. I I find like you have to know also um, how to to match as well because sometimes uh, you you can buy things but they just start looking really funny if, if if you don't know how to match things you know because you're just putting layers and layers on and you know so you got to kind of know how to how to match it but yeah I'm, I'm starting to get used to it I'm starting to um eh, come together and because at the beginning I felt like I didn't look like myself like I, but, but then I started to buy things that were like my style and everything. And it was like, oh, okay. Now I feel, now I feel me, <laughs> you know? Mm -hmm. yeah, that's nice. yeah. Yeah. So it's, it's, mm. yeah, it's different. It really is very, very different. Um, and I'm starting to get used to it actually. Uh, before I, I found that um, like I was, I was really, really, really cold going out but now it's like, oh yeah, okay, like not, not so bad. And the other you're thing, you're getting is, used to it, I guess. Or your body. Used to it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. And the other thing is that, um, like when you're out here in Istanbul, you you get so warm quickly because you're constantly going up and down hills, mm -hmm. up and down hills. Like I, I don't know if you guys have ever seen the hills, like the the streets of Istanbul. But they're not like they're not like this. They're like this, you know. It, it, it's just horrible. Like you really are going. Like I feel like I'm at the gym every day. It's yeah. So it's 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 very easy to get warm because you know you're constantly going up and down, up and down hills. So it's like you you don't feel um, cold at all. You know when you're outside quickly you get you really you get quick um, you get warm very quickly okay yeah yeah all right guys oh hello um let's see it was new i think that's it i think we haven't nobody else has come in hmm wow so i guess today we're gonna have a, a small class i guess everybody is out celebrating could be Valentine's Day teacher. It's Valentine's Day. I guess so. 
<laughs> okay. Well, here we are, the responsible ones. <laughs> Or the single ones. <laughs> or the single <laughs> ones, yeah. <laughs> One of the two. Okay. All right, let's take attendance here. So we have Anna Claudia. Present teacher. Wonderful. David. Present teacher. Wonderful. And Dora Elizabeth. Present. Okay. Fernando Ernesto. Fernando Ernesto. Not here. Fernando Marvin. Fernando Marvin. Francisco Eduardo. Francisco Eduardo. Heidi. Heidi. Present teacher. Wonderful. Ileana. Present teacher. Excellent. Marvin. Harvin. Wonderful. Thank you. Jose Marcos. Jose Marcos. Jose Osmin. Present teacher. Okay, welcome. Jose Wilfredo. Jose Wilfredo, no. Juan Miguel. Juan Miguel. Ramón Enrique. Ramón Enrique. Roberto Luis, Roberto Luis, Roxana Yvette, Roxana Yvette, William Alexander, present, wonderful, Suleyma Yvonne, Suleyma Yvonne, Wendy Patricia, Wendy Patricia, Wilfredo Guardado, Wilfredo Guardado. Okay, wow, there's lots of people missing. Wow, okay. Well, that's that. <laughs> okay. All right, guys. Um, so today is um our 10th day of class. Just a, a reminder before I forget. Well, I won't forget, but just a reminder um that today is our uh, we finish our second week. So that means that you have to have half of unit two finished in the platform just half so you don't have to do everything but you do do have to do half and then next week you will have the other half um up, up to of uh, unit two finished and the midterm okay um any questions about that no did you no it's so it's clear Yeah. Okay. Um, hmm. I'm not sure how I'm going to do this. Hmm. Okay. Um, all right. Well, okay. Let me, let me start. Tell me please, if you can see my PowerPoint. You see it? Yes, teacher. Okay. 
Okay, very good. So um, if the, it's the advanced number four, it's a number 10. The date is, sorry, Tuesday, not Tuesday. <laughs> so Tuesday, February 14th, 2023, facilitator is Jessica Yarraro. Okay, so yesterday um, we were working in groups and uh, to make a conversation right, using the vocabulary that we've been seeing. And we were supposed to be working within these groups here. But I'm just wondering if we have enough people to complete them. So in group number one, we have Francisco Eduardo. Francisco Eduardo is not here. No. Um, Harvin is here, but he's driving. I guess um, in about five minutes, maybe he'll connect. Jose Wilfredo is not here, so that'll be okay. Um, that, so group number one won't work right now. Group number two, we have Anna Colauda, we have Heidi. And that's it, right? Roxana and Ramon are not here. Okay, so group number two may work. Group number three, Fernando Ernesto is not here. I don't I don't think so. Jose Marcos. Is Jose Marcos here? No, Jose Marcos is not here. Um, William Alexander, only William Alexander is here. Okay, so we're going to have problems with that group. Okay, group number four, we have Dora and Ileana. So at least you girls can work together. And Juan Miguel, which is not here, but at least the two girls can work together. Then we have David, Fernando, which is not here, and Wendy. Wendy is not here either, so that's group is going to have problems too. So basically, we're going to have problems with group number three and group number five. Um, what I could do is create a new group with the people from group number three and five. That's what we could do. Okay, so let's, okay, so let's create the groups right now. Give me a moment. Okay, so let me see if I can create this group. Okay, so in group number one, we have, well, Jose Wilfredo is not here, only Harvin. Okay, so that group does not go. Okay. Ana Claudia, we would have, okay, so. So Ana Claudia is working with. I'm fighting with my dog. With <laughs> me. You're yes, fighting with your dog. Yesterday with Roxana and Heidi. Okay, so I think Heidi would be the only one that you can be working. I know Roxana is here. Okay, perfect. So that group is pretty much complete. Okay. Um, in group number two, no, group number three, we had William, together with Jose Marcos, 
which is not here. And Fernando Ernesto is not here either. Okay, so we'll just leave it like that right now. The next group, you have Dora together with Ileana and Juan Miguel is not here. Okay. All right, in group number four, we would have David with Fernando Marvin, who is not here, and Wendy, who is also not here. Okay, so we're gonna do this then. Yeah, I'm gonna have to divide the others, okay? So, um, Let me just make sure. Okay, so um, Okay, Francisco, Eduardo, are you there? Francisco Eduardo, are you there? Apparently he's not. Okay. All right. Um, okay, so we'll put Harvin with group number three and Jose Osmin. So, Smin, are you there? Yes, I'm here. Okay, yes. Perfect. Okay. So, we'll add you to group number four. And in group number one, we'll put Jose Smin. Okay. Jose Smin? Yes, sure. Okay. Um, are you going to be able to participate? Yes. <clears throat> okay, perfect. All right, so, okay, good. So I'm going to open the rooms and I'll give you about 20 minutes. Does that sound good? 20 minutes or do you guys need more time? What do you guys think? Yes. Is that good? Okay. All right, let's open the rooms then. Too bad, I can. Okay. T-shirt. Hi. Can you let us ask to share oh, this? Yeah, yeah, no problem. I'll do that right now. Thank you. <clears throat> Like you should be able to share screen now. <laughs> yes. Okay, this is the idea that we had yesterday. 
Okay. Maybe you can read and let me know if you are agree. Okay. Let me turn my <laughs> Oh, Jesus. <laughs> <clears throat> Sounds good. Yes, only I think we have to add the, the last one, right? Yeah, uh, is digital transformation, right? Yes. I don't know if you have some idea how we can yeah. finish the conversation. Let me read again the conversations. Uh, well, what is the point here? Because I start with a, a problem with a math exercise. And then uh, talk about the PC. Yes. Yeah, like the um the conversation. I understand that that it's, it's like kind of some friend uh, offers to offers help to with the math exercise, right? Yes. And he needs to to turn his PC on. So, but but then he said like uh, he can't. Uh, turn his PC. He turned on his PC because uh, the PC has to update the data driving driven optimization, right? Yes. And then, like another friend, uh, let me let me tell the, the example we have so you can take an idea. I'm going to write it in the chat. The one for automatic auto automation automation automation. And Roxana will be when she gets home, she will be able to share the sentence she made with her group. Let me just let me just grace you the the sentence. The usage for Okay, in the chat, I got the sentence we had with with Heidi. So uh, once Roxana arrive, she will be she will be uh, writing the sentence because. I have the money for this. Okay. And then Francisco says, okay, let me write my 
Analytics, analytics, driven uh, optimization, data driven optimization, analytics, data driven optimization, uh, automation, and, and uh, the last one is what is uh, here? It is digital transformation, digital transformation, analytics, the data driven optimizations, automation, and digital transformation. Okay. And what are we looking for? We are looking for automation and digital, digital transformation. This is two ones. And then we says he's taking a course in, in automation and digital transformation. Okay. Automation and digital transformation. And now, uh, Francisco, talk to David. Hello. How's it going? Talking with a friend. Who needs help? the automation of this office. Can you help us? And David says, of course. Can you help us? What is the question mark? Okay. And, and how are you? Mm -hmm. Apple case and the letter number three. We need to go. Okay, now David answer. Hello, Francisco. Nice to hear about you. Yes, of course. I need to. Quieren que la ponga ahí en el chat. Yes, please write okay. it. The one that you Voy. have with your team. So Jose Osmin can take an idea, or he can get the idea of what we were talking yesterday. And I was explaining to him that we are going to uh, mm -hmm. make a conversation. We're going to talk like about your new project. Okay. Um, because of this automation, the quantity Ana Claudia you finished the midterm already I'm going to work on it I'm just opening the the platform right now because I haven't completed it I remember it was just one 
I guess it's just one missing. Why do you do you want that we check one of those or? Yeah, there's one I can. Let me check. Uh, in the in part number one, asking like favor. Okay. And I want to know if you could help me to resolve it. Okay. That's that could be one participation. Uh, I can go around. Okay. I I will have the problem. Who want to be the next? Let me yes. First, we have to use the analytical ability. Let me turn on my PC. This is in one sentence. Ah, yeah. Coma, let me turn on my PC. Oh, uh huh. That too. Okay, you mm -hmm. will say that. I can go with that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. this is my PC has to update the data driven optimization, the data driven optimization. And I think that um, Dora can finish. Uh, the conversation. Yes. yes your daughter. Yes. I'm doing that manually. Automation process with one app. With one app that can do it for you. The name is Mathway. Mm -hmm. Maybe uh, Harbin, I think that you can participate again with that part. Oh, yes. Like this, right? Mm -hmm. Oh, think. yes. It's one of many advantages on development of the digital transformation, right? And it be a cool with me, and I can say, like, yes, that it's becoming more and more common in our environment nowadays. Yes. And it's becoming, maybe. And not that. Maybe. No, yes, comma, and. Okay. Yes, and is becoming. You just, you just uh, can delete the, that. Mm -hmm. And it is, uh -huh, yeah, right. It's becoming more and more common in our bar, in, in our um, environment nowadays. But nowadays, uh, it's like together, but not together, like, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Yeah. And I think that that's the end. Mm -hmm. Okay, so you girls are finished? Um, I think that we are ready, teacher. Yeah, okay. yes, yes. Remember, remember that we want to practice it as well, right? So that, um, so try to practice as much as you can. Okay. Oh, right. Mm -hmm. Okay, we can practice now. Uh, Harvey, you can start. Okay. Hey, hello, girls. I have a problem with a math exercise, and I want to know if you could help me to resolve it. Yes, Harvey. First, we have to use the analytical ability. Let me turn on my. Yes, we system. need computers. We need computers for computers about. Uh, maybe thirty thousand dollars for computers for software Funny. about ten thousand software yeah yeah ten thousand 
سوري كان توصل يا وات اباوت اي سين وي نيد اباوت 50000 دولارز Y entonces dice William, que lo doble Get it or got it? Got it. I can't get it. Get up it. I can. So, oh. What is, ¿Qué me falta ahí? I can't get it, I can't, eh, lo puedo conseguir, I can't get, get them. I can't get it. I don't know, it's okay. Well... What do you think? Is enough for the yellow? Yeah, for me, maybe it's, it's, it's enough. Um, you can share uh, this okay. conversation in this chat, please. Okay. Computer is is warming. Oh, no problem. It's so slow. I mean, I'm going to go to the billet. So, I need to cuatro gigabytes of RAM para. Más o menos. Un... Lenta. Ok, I think. Is it really then? I will lend the money to Francisco. <laughs> We didn't uh, check some errors on Yeah. Okay. I, I'm going like to separate now. Now it is. Okay, thank you. Also, I want to. Yep. Are you guys ready? Um, I think. Yeah, I think did you yeah you sure yes okay all right perfect IOT I mm -hmm. guess we're we can do it we're ready mm -hmm. yeah we're ready you guys are ready yes teacher yeah teacher perfect all right see you in a minute Okay. By the way, which group are we? Number one, number two, number three? No, no. I, three, I guess. No. I don't know it's because. Wrong. Huh? Yeah, but in the. In, in the in order the of the presentation, uh -huh. I guess. We are different. Mm -hmm. Look at the Zoom meeting at the top. Oh, so we're the room number one, group number one. That's right. Ah, okay, thank okay. you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. We are going to do it.
Do I have everybody back? Yes, everybody back. Okay, all right, perfect. So what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna be performing the conversations with the class. Okay, um, so let's start with group number one and you guys already know who you are. So um, yeah, we're ready for you guys. Hello, Claudia. Okay. No. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's because they, I just came into the, to the... It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> okay, let's start. Hey, hello, team. How are you? Heidi, Jose, Roxana. Hi, everything is okay. How are you? Right. I'm doing very well. Hi, Jose. Hi, I'm Heidi. doing great. Awesome. Doing great. Hey, Roxana, I heard that you're working on a new project, like with an entrepreneur or something like that. Please tell me. Yeah, to be honest with you, we are creating a shared service here in El Salvador. And it's a little complex because, you know, we are working with different countries around the world, different uh, languages and something like that. So uh, that's why it is a little complex. But this is it's interesting because right now we are uh, having, we are uh, getting a lot of changes in the company and uh, because of the importance of the analytics, uh, the team must detail the, the process carefully. Ah, uh, that's and nice. All, yeah. Yeah, that's nice because you are like organizing from the very beginning. You know, in my company happens some something similar, I guess, are high standard for companies that would like to start from the very beginning with good pace, with a strong pace, because in my company, there are also like quarterly reports and they shows, it, it was like a great news and something that nobody knew that the report was showing that the revenue increased 100% in 2022 because of the data driving driven optimization is so, interesting yeah i guess jose has something similar with his company right hmm. jose, jose are you there? <laughs> yeah sorry <laughs> yeah i'm walking out sorry uh yes so remember as well the the uses of autom automation and uh, the machinery of the production uh, it can cause unemployment due to the spread of automation. It can simplify as well the work. It can save time, of course, yeah. right? That's right. Yeah. Yeah, same. and another example of that is that nowadays it's not necessary to visit a bank to open a savings account because of digital transformation. So all of this has come to make our lives easier. You know, just imagine these things didn't happen like 10 years ago. This is due to the IoT, Internet of Things. So every day we need to learn new terms, new conditions, and new things. Okay. Well, it was nice yeah. to talk with you guys. See you. See you. Bye. See you. See you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> All right. Bravo. Very good, girl. Very, very, very good class, uh, or group number one, better said. Uh, very good. Excellent. Um, and you were able to integrate everybody in the group. That's excellent. Okay. So now let's hear Dora, Ileana, and Harvin. Okay. okay. Um, so I can see Dora. Uh, I can see Ileana Harvin. He's gone. Uh, okay, no, there he is. Okay, now, now I can see you. <laughs> okay, perfect. Okay, we're ready. Hey, hello, Ileana. Hello, Dora. I have to, I hope you are great. And I, I have to share with you that I have a problem with some exercise, math exercise, 
and I want to know if you could help me to resolve it. Of course, Harbin. Well, first, uh, I have an idea, and we have to use the analytical ability. Just let me turn on turn on my PC. Give me a sec. Oh, geez. I think that my PC has to update the data-driven optimization. Hello, guys. Don't waste your time doing the manually. You could automate, automate on that process with one app. It does can do it for you. The name is Matt Way. Oh, yes. It's one of many advantages and development of digital transformation, right? Yes, and that is becoming more and more common in our environment nowadays. Okay, you got it. Thank you for the great idea. My pleasure. Okay, welcome, Harvey. Okay, it was a pleasure to see you. Bye. Bye-bye. <laughs> and that's all the truth. <laughs> all right, very good. Bravo. Excellent. Okay. And then we have the last group, which is composed of David, Fernando, Marvin, Francisco Eduardo, and William Alexander. Sorry, teacher, I, I joined it too late. And oh. I didn't. You, you did not. Um, not too sure. Okay. No, I, I, I'm having dinner, so I, I listen to you. Okay, okay. Uh, remember, even if you're having dinner, you can always work with the group, okay? So you can work together, okay? Um, all right, it's so... Okay, so guys, um, it, let me just make sure. Everybody has their cameras on so we can see you. I have my camera on, teacher, and we started working with Fernando yesterday, but at the, at the beginning of the class, uh, we made uh, new groups and we need to adjust the dialogue. Because of that, uh, Fernando is not in this dialogue, but uh, yesterday we, we okay. worked okay. together. All right. Okay, all right, we're ready to hear okay. you guys. Well, uh, we only William, uh, Francisco, and, and I. Okay, are you ready, William? Yep. Go ahead. Hi, Francisco. Are you familiar with the automation of a leader office? We need digital transformation because of the bigger companies. Yes, I know something about that, but I have a friend that can help us too. Really? Can you and your friend help me to automate some tasks for my, of my company? I'm starting a business and I need some help because I have no money for employees. Okay, let me write to my friend David. He's taking a course in automation and digital transformation. Hello, David. How are you? I was I was talking with a friend who needs help with the automation of his office. Can you help us? Hello, Francisco. Nice to hear from you. Yes, of course. I need to put into practice what I am learning about automation and digital transformation. What does your friend need? Okay, I need some automation for invoices, logistics, warehouse, and transportation. Okay, yeah. uh, how much money do you have? Well, I have some money, but uh, if it is necessary, I can get more from the bank. How much do we need? I think we need about uh, $50,000. Okay, no problem. I can get it. Okay, let's do it. And that's it. That's all, teacher. When the project is finished, I, I will invite you to the, the inauguration. <laughs> Excellent. Bravo. <laughs> And I guess William is is uh, very rich. He can. He's like, no, no problem. <laughs> <laughs> I can have one of them. Okay, sounds good. Sounds good, guys. Okay, all right. Just a few words there that I want you guys to practice. Okay, how do we say this word? It's in the chat. Entrepreneur. 
Entrepreneur. Entrepreneur. Entrepreneur. Entrepreneur. Entrepreneur. Okay. All right. So you can you already can hear that we have different pronunciations in the group, right? So let's yeah. let's make sure that everybody has this correct. We say it entrepreneur. 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 And it's pronounced like this because actually this is technically not an English word. I, I was thinking in that. Mm -hmm. It's not an English it's, word. It's for French? Yes, that's correct. It's a French word. Okay. we In English, we borrow a lot of words from different languages, even from Spanish. So this word is French. And that's why the pronunciation is different. It's a, to be honest, it's not even a French pronunciation. It's just it's just a French word, and that in, we've tried to make it to the English, and so that's why we say it. We pronounce it differently in than we would normally in English, and it's actually pronounced very different than than French too. But the idea is there. So it's entre entrepreneur. Entrepreneur. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah. And then there's this word that I know that I keep on um <laughs> I keep on insisting on it. Production. Production. <laughs> Production. That's right. Production. We will never forget that word. I hope not. <laughs> yes, yes. So just remember production. Okay. So not production. Production, no. Okay. Production. Production. Yeah, very good. And um and then there's this word that we've been using. Automation. 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 Yeah. Automation. Yeah. Automation. This, word, this word um contains what we call a flap T. Have we talked about the flap T? I think we have. Yeah. Yeah. It sounds like a like a not like a T with T like um like a, like we say it in Spanish like a I don't automation. know. Automation. Yeah. I like, yeah. I like, Mm -hmm. It's it's a flap T is one of those uh, words where uh, this is more American English. Okay, let's let's uh, let's it's clarify between two that. vowels, right? Yeah, it's the only exactly. thing I remember. Mm -hmm. It's when the T goes between two vowels. In American English, we pronounce it like between a D and an R, so it sounds like a auto automation, not auto automation. Mm -hmm. Okay. And the other thing is not machine, it's may, auto may, automation. Okay. Yeah, automation. Okay. All right. Very good. Excellent, guys. Uh good job. Very, very good job. Okay. Um all right, let's uh continue with our class. Uh, okay, please tell me if you can see my PowerPoint. You see it? Yes. Okay. All right. Very good. Okay. So I have uh, two images there. What do you think these images represent? Just look at the, the just, frequency just, of, a, of a sound. A frequency the of a frequency. sound. 
Very good. Uh -huh. It might be the sound of a heart or something else. Could be the sound of a heart. Mm -hmm. It'd be a system, I see. Okay. I don't know if the uh, talking about that the now mobile devices are able to provide connectivity or internet to other things like an equipment for medical things. I don't know. Okay. All right. Any other ideas? An earthquake alert. It's a an earthquake alert. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What does that have to do? Like, what do you mean an earthquake alert? Can you explain a little bit more? What you mean by that? Uh, I understand this shirt is the is um uh, uh, service provided by Google. Mm -hmm. And they uh, send uh, an alert a few seconds uh, or, or per se, uh, uh, they alert uh, from air, aircraft near from from, uh, from the people. <laughs> I, I understand this yeah. shit, but Mm hmm exactly yeah so we've been talking about internet of things and the internet what can you can you guys remind me what is the internet of things or iot all the equipment that can be can be connect to a interface i'm saying that way but they share like uh I frequency or like a, like they a, can share information or data. They, or they, information. Mm -hmm. they can share information exactly. Yeah. So, um, this uh, there there are now lots of applications that you can download, um, that can share information about, um, your uh, about the the status of your surroundings, right? Using your cell phone, right? Sometimes you can do it manually, right? Um, but not all the time. It doesn't have to be manually that you input the information. Sometimes the cell phone picks up the information without you actually introducing it manually. And this can become very useful for other people that need that information, especially for example, when we're talking about um, earthquake alerts. And so what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna going to, I'm going to be dividing you guys into two groups, just like we did last time. I'm gonna have um, half of you watch a video, okay? And I'm gonna be providing the link and the other half, we're going to be doing something else, okay? So right now, I'm going to divide you guys to two groups. Just give me a moment, guys. Okay, I think I have everybody now. Yeah, okay, so um, I'm going to give you guys a few minutes to see the video and also to take notes or anything that you find interesting, okay? So we're gonna open up the rooms right now. Okay, so this group is going to watch the video, and I'm going to send 
in the chat the link. Um, if somebody can open up uh, the link and share with the rest, please. Somebody got the video? Okay. Um, it's Tuesday. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys, um, guys and girls. Um, so this is um the group that is not going to watch the video just yet okay so um uh we're going to actually be doing something else um i'm going to be showing you um this all right so these what can you see here Sorry, what? All kind of asset that can be hooked to the internet. Okay, like what? what? What do you see? What kind of things do you see here? AOT. Sorry? AOT. AOT or IOT? IOT. Okay, IOT. Okay, good. Very good. Can you name a, a few of the IOTs that you can see? Smart watch. There's a smart watch. Very good. What else? And drone. There's a drone. Mm -hmm. Camera. There's a camera. Mm -hmm. What else? Wi-Fi. Wi Keyboard. The Keyboard. USB. US. Uh, a USB. US. Actually, yeah, this is this is actually in English. Do you guys know what this is called? There are USB that they are used to uh, connect one equipment to another with wireless. And there are others that they are used just for saving information, data. Yeah. A uh, from a drive but, but what do we call this device? Drive pen tissue? Huh? Or pen, so pen drive? A pen drive? USB? Uh, actually, we call it a flash drive. Oh, flash, flash drive. drive. Mm -hmm. okay. Yeah, flash drive. I'll write it in the chat. Flash. Not as a USB. You can we can call it USB, but we it's actually a USB flash drive. Ah, okay. okay. Okay, so yeah, not just USB because USB is the actual um the. The type of connection right but the mm -hmm. device itself is called the flash drive okay all right oh okay. uh, just give me a Baker. moment um sorry what, what else stickers stickers okay stickers 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 Virtual speaker. Oh, speak, uh, I was like, okay, I, I don't remember seeing stickers. Okay, yes, yeah, speakers. Yes, yeah, very good. Speakers. Speaker. Mm -hmm. What else? Virtual reality lens. Virtual reality what? Lens. 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 Lenses. Okay, virtual reality lenses. Uh huh. Very good. What else? iPad iPads. Okay, very good. Anything else that you cannot see? Mouse. Mouse, a mouse, good. A Excellent. router. A router. 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 Mm -hmm. The same okay. thing happens about the flap T, right? So router. Mm -hmm. Router. Okay. Um PS4. <laughs> A TS4? Yeah. All right. Um, and what are these? Uh, 
What? Which one? These oh. ones here. Perfect. Yeah, they're headphones. And if you notice, they don't have any wires. So what do you what kind of headphones are those? Wireless. Mm -hmm. They're wireless, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, exactly. Um, okay, very good, very good. So all of these are part of the um we can use them as the internet of things. Now which of these devices do you have? A laptop. Laptop? Cell what? phone. A cell phone? In my case, laptop, cell phone, uh, headphone, wireless, connecting by Bluetooth. Okay. And router. A router, okay. Right. Mouse, and a mouse, a mouse. We because the laptop have keyboard, mm -hmm. and mm -hmm. for me that's it. Okay. Oh, what about the rest camera. of you? I have a camera with connection mm -hmm. to the internet. Okay, very good, very good. Anything else that you guys have? The mobile device. <laughs> The router. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Router. Yeah. Okay. All right. Is there anything here that um that you have never seen before? You've never seen in real life? A drone. In my oh. case, I haven't touched any or used a drone. Okay. How can I say drive or oh, oh. manage a drone? How can we say? Drive, drive, drive again. All of them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you drive it. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you can drive a drone. Yeah. Teacher, what is the the device between the laptop and iPad? Oh, it's. I think that's an iPad. Uh, no, I. I think that the one is an iPad and the other one is a tablet. I think it is. Or no? Oh. Maybe the first one is the laptop. The second in the first floor is maybe a Kindle or something like this. Could be. Not a dongle, right? Those equipment that are just for reading books. A Kindle. Yeah, like right. Kindle. I, I have yeah. one Kindle for read. Okay. okay. I yeah, keep up to my list. Ah, okay. All right. Very good. Yeah, actually, yeah, you're right. It does look like a Kindle. It looks like like there's writing. Yeah. Uh-huh. It's true. Okay. Very good. Excellent. Okay. All right, guys. I'm going to stop right now sharing, and we're going to go back to the main room. Okay. Okay. All right. So guys, um, group number one, uh, before anything, before I, I get you guys to, um, well, the, before we, we, we go back to the groups, um, have you ever used an application like the one that you saw? My case never teacher. Never. 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 Okay. I use it, but in my phone, just um a, like a function. Mm -hmm. Okay. So but it's not enough. Yes, not enough. Day, all the company send a message. Mm -hmm. What do you mean? For example, I have a car company in myself and when it Harman, when... we can't see you. 
We and can't see you. Right now? No. Nope. <laughs> Sorry, I don't know what happened with my mic. No, your mic is fine. We can you're, see you. We can't see you. The 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 the, the camera. Ah, okay, okay. Let me. Let me. Ah, there you are. Okay. Low battery in my in my PC, but okay. Um, okay. For example, uh, right now nowadays, all the company send an automatic and text messages when happen an earthquake. Which companies? All here, Claro, Tigo, Tijiso, all the but companies think, do it. Jarvin, but I think it is about the cell phone. Really? Yeah. Because for me, for example, I, I, I received the notification from the company. I, I received the notification for Google without the application. Google said uh -huh. an alert. Did you receive a test message? Yes, a test uh, message. Uh, uh, an, an alert, a, a sound, like an alarm, and, and then a message. Yes, yes. Before uh, or after? Before, before the earthquake, about a... Uh, 10 yeah. seconds before the earthquake, and it was an earthquake about uh, 6.6. And, and six. It was uh, very strong, and, and it was... Uh, and then they sent a, a survey asking if, uh, uh, what do you do? But uh, uh, I I was uh, sleeping, and I continue sleeping. <laughs> I don't get up on an earthquake. I, <laughs> I, 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 I remain sleeping, and it was... Uh, uh, but many people get up. I, I know. I, I continue zipping. In El Salvador, our, our house are, are uh, well constructed and we don't have uh, more problems uh, with earthquake because uh, this is uh, an, uh, a country that suffers earthquakes every year. Yeah. And the, many of the houses in, in our country are, are building in, with this in mind. And we yeah, don't need to run. Mm -hmm. Unless it was a night or 10 or more degrees. Nine or 10? Was, uh, uh, <laughs> yes, in, in the 1986, uh, it was uh, night race. It was very strong in the in the downtown of San Salvador. And, uh, it was nine? Uh, yes, in, in nine, really? yes. In uh, 1986, yes. Really? Yes, wow. it was uh, a very, very uh, uh, strong and wow. difficult for the people. But this it was the only one of that grade. Hmm. Wow! And, uh, but I don't think I don't think there has been many uh, in history. I don't think there have have been many tens. Very, very, very. Uh, no, tens. only only one in 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 Chile. Mm hmm. Chile was uh, actually yes. The actually that reminds me. You just remind, remind, reminded me of something. They say that the earthquake in Chile was so strong that it actually uh, changed the, um, the the geography of the country. No, not the geography. Um, the what's it called? Uh, the deep of the sea. No, 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 no. Um, what do you call this? Let me see if I can remember what you call it. Um, you know, because let, let's say like the angle, the the angle of the earth. The angle of rotation, yes. Yeah, yes. yeah. Change the angle of rotation of the, of the, of the earth. Yeah. And that uh, caused that uh, a little... Uh, milliseconds uh, the, the day was affected yeah. the and axis, the same was the axis yes. that's the word the axis mm -hmm. of the earth yeah yes mm -hmm. the same was in in indonesia the same mm -hmm. situation and in, in, in indonesia the deep of the sea it was a uh, uh, 30 meters and then on, was only four the sea lost uh, 26 meters in deep Mm -hmm. In Indonesia, in the in the, this part of Indonesia, yeah. the, the island. Wow, yeah, that's pretty interesting. 
Okay. All right. So guys, what we're going to do right now, we're going to go back again to the groups. And now group number two is going to watch the video. Okay. Uh, so let's open up the groups again. All right, guys, so I'm going to share the, the link and can someone open it and share with the class? Earthquakes are unpredictable. Now okay. All right, guys. So um, you guys have seen a little bit of how IOTs work in real life. Um, so let's actually discuss a little bit about the devices that are related to IOTs. What can you see in this image? Headphones. Glasses. What kind? What kind of headphones? Um, like a gamers. <laughs> I don't know. Okay. Uh, do they have cables? No. So like, what kind of what kind um, of headphones would that be? Um, I forgot the word. Mm. You guys can help her as well. What kind of what 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 do you what do you call something when it doesn't have a cable? Wireless. 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 Yeah. yeah so okay. Wireless. So they're wireless headphones. Very good. What else? What else can you see? Part of the yeah. IoT system. A USB. Okay. Good. What do you? Okay. So this is when we're talking about USB. We are, we are owing. Yeah. Um. Yeah, so the, the, yeah, exactly. Just, but just give me a moment. Um, I want to explain something. Okay, so when we're talking about um, USB, we're just talking about this little part right here. Okay, and it's the type of the connection. Okay, so the whole thing here, what do we call that whole thing? Pen drive? Yeah, we can call it a pen drive or a flash drive. Okay, so I'll write in the chat here. It depends on 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 what kind of what the what it looks like basically. It's okay. All right, very good. Uh, what else? What else can you see? A laptop. A laptop. Mm -hmm. Camera. Tablet. Tablet. Game control. Smart watch. Smart watch, yes. Um, yes. Hmm? Wireless keyboard. A wireless keyboard. Very good. Where's A drone. Drone. Camera. Drone. Camera. Mm -hmm. Very good. This vir vir virtual. What well, is reality virtual lens? What is the name of that? Something like that. Virtual lens. Virtual yeah. lens, yes. yeah. Mm -hmm. This one right here. Yeah, very good. Yeah. Okay. All right, very good. Uh, which of these devices have you used? Mm. Keyboard, mouse, mm -hmm. a smart, a smartwatch, a laptop, a tablet, tablet. router, ear, earphones. Earphone. Well, yeah, earphone. Actually, these are more like headphones. So earphones are like the ones I have. These are earphones. And then uh, the ones that go on your head, those are called headphones. Headphones. Ah, yeah. okay. Mm -hmm. 
Hal France. Yeah. Interesting. Mm -hmm. Okay. What else? What else have you used? Um, what is this thing? Does everybody know? iPad. iPad? No. Yeah, I think that is iPod, mm -hmm. right? iPod. iPod. An iPod. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, exactly. Very good. Um, have have you have any of you ever used one of these? No, not yet. Not yet? No. No. Neither. Not yet. Nobody? No yet. Okay. No teacher, I only use those that uh, you use in the in the uh, when you put a, a disc with the <laughs> and, and, and you were scrolling the disc and, and you see a, a story a, a Disney story, but this <laughs> these are all all things, but uh, it was uh, the first in, in virtual reality. I, I don't know. I, I can explain that, but. The, the, I'm the, confused. The, the old pictures, the old picture has a a, a film that uh, called the negative, and with that picture you can do a, a song that you can uh, see the, through the light, and there was a lenses that you can uh, see that kind of pictures, and you see in 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 three D. Okay, I think I know what you're talking about. It's like like a like a kind of like a, a game. It's something like that. Yes, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay. It okay. was for 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 a, a key holders. The only one picture, and there was a this with many of them. Mm -hmm. Okay, interesting. You can put a picture of you of you and and and, and in the key key holder. Mm -hmm. It was uh, amazing because you will see in, in, in 3D. Interesting. All right. Very interesting. Okay. Um, how many of you have... Oh, oh but so do you guys know what this is? Anybody know? No teacher. No? If I'm not mistaken, that is a Kindle. You guys know what a Kindle is? Kindle. Mm -hmm. A Kindle. Sure. No? Could you write that the, the spell? Kindle like a like a light. Mm, I don't know. I've I've never Kindle? Kindle? Oh, the, the, the no, same oh word? no, no, no. Kindle. Ah. Kindle. Okay. Ah, okay. To read. Yes. Ah, okay. Yes. yes. Do you guys know what it is? Yes, I, I, I was used, but not the for. It's mine. It's uh, for my students. They have something like that. Yeah. Exactly. Can you explain what a Kindle is? It's a, a library with many books. You can download, buy books, and read. It. Really neat is especially for read. Yeah, exactly. It's basically like reading a book, except that it's electronic. But it's it 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 um has like the same mm, texture. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it, but um, but it looks like you really are reading a real book. You know, it it doesn't have the 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 screen is not shiny like a like a like a computer it's it, it looks like a real book right so yeah and it's you can read electronic books very good okay guys so the time's over so we're going to return to the main room um so i'll see you guys in a moment
Okay. All right, guys. So now that you have all seen the video, um, tell me, do you think that it's something that could be useful, if, for example, in El Salvador? It needs to teach it. It is important because uh, we lost many people in the place named the Las Colinas. I live uh, about uh, eight blocks from Las Colinas. Oh. And uh, we go to that place and we try to, to rescue people with uh, the hands, with the, uh, whatever we have. Wow. There are no uh, instruments and, yeah. and we, we don't we can't locate the people because there there was no street. There was there there is only a, 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 like a mountain, and a, it was a, so difficult. And it was a, and if we ha, if we will have a, something like that. Mm -hmm. We can do a better job. It is a, a important. It, it the same thing was in the, the Tarillo building. In 1986, mm -hmm. there was about uh, 2,000 mm -hmm. people trapped into the building, mm -hmm. and it, it was dogs. It was uh, uh, people uh, trying to rescue the people, but uh, there was no idea where the people was. Mm -hmm. And if we have something like that, it was a, a very important, necessary. Uh, even though I, I don't know if applied, but uh, we have people that lost in the mountain. I, I don't know. Maybe can can do an adaptation, but uh, I don't know if they fall. So some some guys fall in the in the volcano of uh, San Salvador, and volcano. there was a, a volcano. Volcano, okay, mm -hmm. volcano. And there was some some uh, helicopters, uh, choppers, uh, trying to to locate them, but uh, it was impossible. Mm -hmm. and there was in, in that place for about uh, two or three days. Wow, I didn't know. And that. I don't know, I don't know if can apply the same application or something similar, but it was is important to 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 rescue the people. Mm -hmm. Absolutely, very good. What do you guys think? Do you think something like this could work in El Salvador? Uh, mm -hmm. It's for me. About, about this kind of application. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Or yes. alarm. Yeah. Um, I don't remember, but I think a couple of months ago, a uh, there were some, I don't know how to say, pequeños terremotos or temblores, I don't know, mm, earthquakes. Yeah, yeah earthquake. but, shakes. Yeah. Okay, shakes. So, um, like, uh, for example, five or six seconds before the shake, uh, in my wife's uh, cell phone, uh, she got an alert that. Uh, there, there, uh, like a, it will be a shake. So take your, or maybe get ready your shoes and to cover in, a, in some way. So, uh, for me, yeah, it's kind of uh, functional, yeah, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. because <laughs> in that case it, it was a little shake, yeah, shake, mm -hmm. yeah, but. Mm -hmm. uh, you have the the alert or the alarm and obviously if you take this kind of things uh, seriously you uh have maybe not the enough time but you have a, a little time to get ready and maybe to run uh, like run yeah like to get prepared for for maybe other other kind of things that Absolutely. could happen. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. It's... For example, <laughs> like people said, you have to take a puñado. I don't know how to say. A fistful. Brother, no. No, puñado, puñado, como de. Ah, uh, right. Sorry, sorry. Full. Fistful of of 
uh, dog food. Yeah, and take it. And, okay. And, and if the building comes to you, the dogs will smell the. <laughs> oh. Uh -huh. We will smell the the mm. the the dog the doggy. Yeah. 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 Uh -huh. Mm, it, it's kind of it's kind of uh funny yeah but uh but it works yeah yeah I yeah mean, it, it, it works it makes it makes sense it makes perfect sense yeah yeah, yeah. wow huh i've never really thought of that but i'm you know what i'm gonna i'm gonna do that i'm going to go and get <laughs> i'm gonna buy some duck, dog food yeah no it's it's true i mean it sounds funny, but these things actually can work, right? Yeah. Um, yeah, and, and sometimes, I mean, six seconds doesn't sound like a lot, but think about everything you can do in six seconds when it when it's um about uh finding a place so that you can save your life. I mean, have you guys ever heard of uh the triangle of life? Yeah. Yes. 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 Who can who can explain what the triangle of life is? There are some uh, some uh, uh, furnitures that uh, uh, in a in a special part of the furniture is a um, a triangle that uh, you can put at the side. No. Uh, under but at the side at the side of the building and uh, in that part of the of the building uh, you can uh, get more protection that is you pull under because if something heavy it fall on the on the furniture uh, the furniture can resist in in that part in, on the and in, in the side mm -hmm. and you can uh, uh, get a little horse only Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Uh, so basically, a triangle of life is uh, they have found that the people that have survived uh, natural disasters like uh, like the earthquakes, they have been able to survive because they have put themselves in a position where they where it forms where the things that that fall form a triangle with something that is parallel. So if you have something that is um, that we have like a like it forms like a, a ninety degree angle, like the floor, and something straight, right? You have a ninety degree angle, and something falls. It usually falls not straight down, but it actually falls. And like hits, and so it forms like a little triangle. And in that little space, that little space that is left, if you are there in that little space, then you can save your life. And so that's why they say that the best thing that you can do if you're inside of a building is not try to escape the building. Don't ever try to escape a building when there is an earthquake. Try to put yourself in the triangle of life position. So like up against something, right? Um, that is in a 90 degree angle and the floor and put yourself as small as possible. Make yourself as small as possible. And that will be give you more of a chance of surviving than, um, than trying to escape. Like, you know, for example, here, you guys obviously know the 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 news about the horrible earthquake that there, there have been in, in in Turkey and the majority of the people that they found dead were those people that were trying to escape the, the, the you know unfortunately those are the people that that you know lost their lives so it's not about moving as quickly as possible but it's more more about putting yourself in a in a in a right position but of course these devices that we're, we're talking about the internet of things these all of these devices that gather information can really 
be useful even in saving our lives. Yeah. But now imagine if these devices didn't exist. Imagine that all of those devices that we've talked about, the ones that we, we saw that I showed you on the screen, imagine that none of those things existed. What would life be like? Don't answer. Don't answer. I just want you to meditate on it. What would life be like if none of those devices of IOTs existed? And what we're going to do right now is, I know we have uh, not very many minutes, but in these few minutes that we have, I'm going to put you into breakout rooms, and you're going to be discussing that, okay? And you're going to be creating a, a short um, a presentation on what you think life would be, how it would be different if IOTs didn't exist. Now, it you could be something that you believe, for example, that it's good. It's good if it would be life would be better if IOTs didn't exist, or you would think that maybe it would life would be really bad if IOTs didn't exist. So you can decide on what you believe would be if it would be good or bad. It's up to you. Okay. But I want you guys to discuss, and you're going to be do making a presentation next class or tomorrow. And so you're going to just start talking about that today, okay? Do you guys understand what we're going to be doing? I, I don't need to sing about that teacher because I leave it. <laughs> I leave no, you don't. Mean, with the, with no, the, you don't. <laughs> I, 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 I start using it with the first computers, the, the, the computers that don't have an internal program. They're, they're starting using the, the holiday call, the, the cards, the performer cards. But, okay, but we're talking about nowadays. We're not talking about back then. We're talking about now in 2023. Imagine that, I don't know, there was a... A, a global natural disaster and everything, all of the devices that were part of the IoT, you know, could not work. How would it be different? Okay. Okay. So, Is okay. everything get uh, uh, ruined okay. and we can't we can't use it? How would life be different? Okay. So I'm going to open the rooms right now. José Asmín, no, no, no lo daré eso, ¿no? Hola. Eh, ¿No lo mandó? No, 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 pero sí ya me aparece aquí sala de grupo reducido. Ah, oh, ok, you can join. Ok. Um, I think that it will be um, kind of um, maybe a disaster inside another disaster because you don't you won't have or you wouldn't have any way of communication with other people maybe relatives maybe your uh, yeah, your people next to you, and obviously there, there maybe there was a a big uh, confusion uh, because of the um the ins insecurity. No sé si es así está bien dicho inseguridad. Insecurity, insecurity. Pero, pero 
inseguridad como personal, vea. Okay. For example, I, I don't know where is my, my son or maybe... What do you think, Dorita? I think that everything will be a kind of difficult, the communication. Um, maybe the 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 co the commerce it's, it's that uh, the word the commerce between countries or maybe in the same country will be kind of difficult slowly not as fast as the, no not as fast as it is today right yeah It's like, um, I don't know. I don't know. I can imagine the life nowadays without all these devices. We all use these devices for work, for everything. Can you imagine it because you haven't lived without them. Well, we have lived without them. <laughs> A tape record. Uh -huh. I remember when my dad gave me uh, for a birthday uh, a tape record and I was happy. <laughs> I use a, a cassette. <laughs> yes. In this case. For me, it's a matter of Costumbre, ¿cómo se dice? How do you say costumbre, teacher? Um, a habit or a um oh or what exactly what kind of for example, maybe Dorita and I we have lived without internet. Mm -hmm. Um we were used to live like that. You cannot miss something you don't have. Right. If you take away right now all of all of those tools, it might be catastrophic, but but if we wouldn't have known how to use them, we would live without them. Mm -hmm. Because we would be used to. Yeah, right. Um yeah, you're you're accustomed to them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you're accustomed to it. You're, yeah. It's Just like we are, we are, we are. It's part of you. It's part of your days. everyday life. Mm -hmm. But imagine what would happen though if all of a sudden you woke up one day and those IOTs did not exist. Maybe Dorita and I would know what to do because we already did, but did you know that is Ileana never saw a fox? <laughs> she knows what it is, but she never saw one. Really? Yeah, Ileana, she was you're... young. <laughs> I don't know. You don't know what a fox is? I know what is a fox. Uh -huh. And I was so <laughs> Heidi that I remember that when you called a fox or you left a message, the facts uh, may made this kind of noise a little bit weird, but I don't remember. I don't have in my in my brain or in my memories a picture or 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 that I maybe use or or see a so a facts. There, are, I think there are still companies that use facts. Oh, really? Yeah. Really? Yeah, I think so. What if I'm not mistaken. Email. And images. No. Yeah, I mean scanners are more common, but but yes, um uh, I I think they're even in, in the United States, um people still really? use yeah. Yeah, they still use it. Yeah. Okay. 
<laughs> okay, well, we're going to return to the main room because time has caught up with us. Okay, so I'll see you girls in a moment. Okay. Bye. Okay, guys and girls, so um, we are going to continue this discussion tomorrow because you will be presenting your ideas. Um, but in the meantime, I need to take attendance. Okay, so um, Ana Claudia? Present teacher. David? Present teacher. Dora? Present. Fernando Ernesto? Fernando Ernesto, Fernando Marvin, present. Eh, Francisco Eduardo, present issue. He, um, Heidi Eugenia, present teacher. Ileana, present teacher. Harvin, present teacher. Jose Marcos, present. Jose Osmin. Present teacher. Jose Wilfredo. Juan Miguel. I'm here, I'm here, present, present. Uh, Ramon. Ramon. Ramon Enrique. Roberto. Eh, Roxana. Present. Eh, William. Present. Suleima. Wendy. Wilfredo Guardado. Okay. All right, guys and girls. So we're going to uh, finish there today. And like I said, tomorrow we're going to continue with um, the, the, the discussion. And just remember that today you need to uh, turn in half of unit two, section number two, okay? So that will be all for today. And I'm just going to stay with Jose Marcos, okay? Everybody else, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you. Bye-bye. Yeah, see you. Bye, everybody. Bye-bye. Say goodbye to everybody. Uh, Ramon Enrique, are you there? Ramon Enrique? Okay. All right. Hello, Jose Marcos. How are you? Hello, teacher. Fine. Good, good. Yeah. Excellent. Sorry. How was your day to, at work today? Uh, no, I didn't work today. Oh, okay. You so had a day off today. Of, no, it's the, the time, the approach of the incapacity. Today. Oh, that's right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. How are you feeling? Um, good, good. Um, um, I think I can walk better because I have a sprain. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I, I sprain so my my feet was very big, but the uh, the um, it's, I don't know what to say this. It's inflammation. It's swollen. Ah, okay. It's swollen. It's swollen. So, I'll write in the chat. Yeah. <laughs> that uh, medical vocabulary. Mm -hmm. Swollen. Ah, okay. <laughs> so, yeah, I think I, I, I get well soon. Mm, okay, good, good, good. 
Um, have you have you taken any medication? Yeah, I, I've been taking. I've been uh, ibuprofen. Ibuprofen. And... Okay, uh, mm -hmm. methyl carbamol. Mm -hmm. uh, and some, um, I don't know how to say this, injection. Injection. The so. Injection, okay. Uh, the medicament for that injection uh, was like uh, disinflammatory. <laughs> mm -hmm. And now, uh, uh, anesthetico, but I don't know the, the name of that, but. I think I will recover uh, just by myself. I, I will not continue with the pills or the medication really? because I feel I feel better right now. Yeah. Feel Are you better. sure you're gonna you're gonna get better without? Yeah, yeah, because it's only for the muscles. So okay. and the and the uh, body age. Mm -hmm. But I think I uh, I think I recover very well. Okay. Good. Okay. Good. Good. Yeah. Uh, tomorrow uh, I will I will work so mm -hmm. uh, okay. everything is going to to come back to you know, to yeah. normal life to me. So, yeah. But, it sometimes yeah. also like um after after you recover from the sprain. Um, what I suggest, because your 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 ankle is going to be very weak, um, I suggest that you do some some exercise with the, with the, your ankle because oh, it's okay. it's your ankle, right? Your ankle is the one that got sprained, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. The, okay. And the right and the left, not right foot. And the right what? Right. Uh... Foot. Foot. Uh -huh. yeah. yeah, okay, yeah. So it's going so it's going to be a bit weak, right? Because you're um you haven't been used it using it very much and it's and it's um and it's uh you know been hurt, it's injured. So what I suggest is that you do some exercise to strengthen the the ligaments, right? Okay. Um so um, that's gonna do. That's gonna help a lot. Um, you you like you look like for example, you can go on YouTube and look for videos on um, exercises to strengthen your ankles, right? Like, oh, okay. mm -hmm, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah, um, yeah. That's gonna help a lot. And I'm, I'm telling you from from experience. I'm I'm one of those people that all the time is you know having sprains. Um, and that has helped me a lot um, to strengthen my my um, my muscles from my ankles. That helps a lot. Yeah. So so, but do it until you feel that you're better. Don't do it now. <laughs> okay. Do yeah, it. Yeah. Like, yeah, yeah. Do it maybe in about like a like a month time. You know. Oh, about a, okay. in a, yeah. About three weeks. Give it about yeah. Give it about three to four weeks. Um, to to heal properly, and then start strengthening it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I I I always start to do exercise. For example, sometimes I do exercise after my my schedule, my my shift at I five p.m. to six p.m. and also I go to play with some friends in, in the night and sometimes and on the weekend so. But in this case, uh, because of the the all the way of the motorcycle, uh, hit me with the mm -hmm. floor. Mm -hmm. uh, I think it, it, it was very so the the to not in in order to not uh, get that sprain. So I think my my muscles are are kind of strength. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I will, uh, I will take that advice because after a a, a hit like that, a, a hurt or injure, injury, injury like that, mm -hmm. injury like that, yeah, uh, yeah, 
they are kind of weak. So yeah, exactly. Yeah. yeah, yeah, they become weak. So that it's very important that you strengthen them, and that will also because also remember that because it's weak, it it you if you don't strengthen it, you expose yourself to getting a second sprain. So that's why it's important to to strengthen the muscle and the ligaments. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and the tendons <laughs> and all of that. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I always start to yes, the bones. Too. Too. Yeah. 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 No. yeah. Very good. Yeah, exactly. And it's good that to do exercise because um the you know, you say that you do exercise, you probably have noticed that um, it, sometimes when you fall, you may fall and you may hurt yourself, but that's it. That's all you do. You don't, like, for example, I'm sure that with the, if you didn't do any exercise with the type of uh, accident that you had, you probably would not have had a sprain. You would have probably broken the bone. Yeah, yeah. The, the doctor that told me, Tell me something like that. that mm -hmm. I have, I, mm -hmm. I, I'm very lucky because I have any uh, broken bone. Yeah. Uh, and it's because you don't have a broken bone because you do exercise. Because when you do exercise, you make the, the muscles and the ligaments more flexible. And so because they're more flexible, they are able to, to, um, to bend and not let the bone break. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So so it they they stretch and they in and, and they don't they don't make the bone break. And so so that's why it's it's important to do exercise. Yeah. So hopefully you'll be okay. That's yeah, you know. Yeah. yeah. So to so tomorrow you start work, right? Because it was only the 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 work the sick leave was until today, right? Yeah, I asked for uh, two, four days, including mm -hmm. the Saturday, Saturday mm -hmm. and Sunday, Monday. The, the doctor told me that for a sprain, all, all the time, almost, they, they give like a, a week. Mm -hmm. But I consider that it's not, it's not necessary because as, I work from home. Uh, I'm not doing so so much activity, mm -hmm, so, mm -hmm. or or I need to to I mm -hmm. can recover. Yeah, yeah. Why well, I decide to just took a uh, Monday and start and Tuesday. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Hopefully, then I'll be okay. Yeah. Um. And on a different note. Um, how are you doing with the platform? Do you have any questions? Do you have any problems? Uh, no, no, right now, no. Uh, uh, he said that we must finish the second unit by this night. Not finish the second unit, but half of, of the unit. So I think, let me just make sure. I think there's about there are about um this is the half. For example, there are like five exercise or six exercise. Yeah. Three. Exactly. So yeah, exactly half of it. Oh. Um so you finish half it tonight. And then um, next Tuesday, which would finish unit, it would be um, uh, the third week. Uh, for the third week, you would um, you would be finishing the unit two and the midterm. Ah, okay, okay. okay. All right. Yeah, okay. Um, so the duration of these courses is five weeks. Five right. weeks, yeah, exactly. Yeah, I, five I, weeks. I thought it, it was like one more and half. No, 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 just five, just five weeks. Okay. 
Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Um, any problems, any questions with what we have been seeing? Mm, no, no, right now. Just, uh, everything's okay. Just I think I can I can do it better with the vocabulary because I sometimes I get short of words. Oh no, no, I, but you're I, doing so. great. Actually, I really thank you for your input as well in the class. The fact that you um you're helping us out with um uh, with your knowledge, the the knowledge that you have acquired with from work and everything. And so I I really appreciate um your your input to the class. That's great. Okay, thank you. Yeah, and anything else that you need, any questions that you have, remember that you're uh, we're available on in the WhatsApp group, and also you can you can send me a me a direct message if that works better. You can send me a direct message so I can help you out. Okay. Okay, teacher. All right. It's good to hear that. Thanks. Of course. Um, anything else I can help you with? Um, no, everything to do. Right. Okay, wonderful. All right, in that case, Jose Marcos, um, that'll be all. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, I hope so. Okay, yeah. all right, take uh, care. Have a good day. Thank you, you too. All right. Yeah, a good night. <laughs> oh, yeah, good night. You're right. Good night. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, good Bye. day for you. Bye. Yeah, exactly. Bye. All right, good night. Good night. Good. See you later. See you later.